So, so we'll talk about what are the opportunities you think that, that, that we have out there, for example. Uh, what do you think blocks leaders from block leaders from from having these vulnerable, authentic discussions and connecting with people around what's um, uh, what's I don't know what's holding them back, what's what's um, what's uh, destroying them emotionally and and um, spiritually and so on. I mean, isn't there a, a, an attitude of firstly, there's more pressure on the work environment. So the logical mind says we've got to do more, we've got to put more pressure on the people, we've got to act faster, we've got to um, have more meetings, we've got to step it up, guys, step it up, your pace must step it up. So, so it almost got, got, it, it counters the need to sit quietly and peacefully and have a, a real authentic open discussion about your fears and concerns and anxieties and you know what I'm saying, individually all around the table, just, just that it feels counterintuitive to have to waste time when the business is on fire. Now, this Austria business, which is an international business, they thought they were going to break even now in December. Suddenly, it's lockdown, and they lose millions every day that they're in lockdown. So they will not even break even maybe in December. So they just think they're re recovering. We felt it in our small business. We just feel like we're starting to get momentum out of COVID. Bang. And then another thing, we've got looting and this and that. So I think just as you respond further on what we can learn from COVID and we want to go into opportunities potentially, just think about what's stopping leaders from, from doing that counterintuitive thing. So Angelique, yeah, go for it. I mean, your thoughts. John, I'm going to go back to your movement, which is the Think Lead ecosystem. And, you know, you and I were quite closely on the same level of thinking uh, because what you are talking about in your organization I believe is the key. I believe that leaders are afraid to make themselves vulnerable.